Now, just in case you're wondering, Maya is in a cage for her breakfast, as she is for her supper, because a certain person, if I go away or out of the kitchen, will go and steal her breakfast. Even though he has breakfast right here, he much prefers everybody else's breakfasts first. So for Maya's protection and her breakfast's protection, because she doesn't eat it right away. She, as you can see, she's going to have a sleep first, having done morning rounds and rushed around in the fields before she has her breakfast, which she's left alone. So that's dog life. This is the only way Maya will get food is to put her in a cage so that she'll eat it when she feels like it, not when he feels like it. Because if he feels like it, there's no breakfast for Maya. Isn't that right, Inca? Whereas you eat your breakfast, don't you? And yes, Inca will steal her daughter's breakfast as well, but Maya is not an enthusiastic eater. Anyway, the kettle is on. The aga is clean. The cat is back on the aga. Isn't that right of a minute? And I am going to have make my tea for breakfast. He's ready, and Ovenmit is back on his throne.